there's value to hitting loop ground strokes in singles. It's high percentage. Loops give you a difficult ball to attack, it gets the ball out of people's zones, and it's very high percentage. Keys are, watch the file through the setup. Here's your drive. Racket stays very flat through the plane. It's very easy to hit a loop off a flat shot. If you can't match the power of the person, hit the loop, give yourself time. Because not only does he hit the ball, but look where he can recover and get back into position very easily. And you force the person back. Here's a drive, he's inside the court, throws a loop, and now it's a neutral point. Look how far back the person has to get. To master the drive, you have to have simulated feeds and focus on contact point and finish. Drives are all products of the contact point and the plane. Look at the ball, it's pretty much a flat level plane. This takes a lot of time. This is a very big guy too, so the ball is actually really high. He's about 6'2 maybe. So it's the ball catching the ball on the rise. For most of us, you can use the wall to catch the ball on the rise if you don't have someone feeding you balls. And it's all about the swing plane. Catch the ball as it comes up, make impact, and go through the shot. Right there. See, it bounces up, it comes up, it comes through the shot. Get used to catching the ball early, driving through the ball, having a good swing plane. Now you force the guy back, right? Throw the loop back at them again. Look at this clearance. Look how far back the guy in the white shirt is now. It's very difficult to catch the ball on the rise, so he, he fades back and lets the ball drop. But when you do that, go to the corner. Use the loop to go to the corners. He draws a short shot because he goes to the corner and goes to the next corner now. Get him in the corner. Use the loop to go to the corner. Once you're in court, this should be a drive because he's in the court right there. That should be more of a, a flatter shot. But he gets the error. The, the key we're talking about here is use the loop to counter flat shots. Use the loop as your rally ball and use the loop to move the person around.